Hi everyone, welcome to the New York Times Hard Sudoku for Friday, March the 8th, 2024. Looking at the grid I see here, this is slightly different in that there's hardly anything in box 3, or row 7, or row 9, and there's nothing at all in box 7. On the other hand, box 1, box 4, and column 3 all have 5 digits. I think I'll start there. But here's some fives that can intersect in there. Uh, well, okay, these sixes are going to go here. These eights are going to go here. One, two. Oh, actually, wait a minute. This eight and this eight force an eight, one of these. But these are rolled out because of this one and that one. So eight in box six is actually placed. And I could have done that from the columns. In the bottom rows, I got nothing, but let's see. Okay, what looks in? Uh, four looks up. So four is one of those two in box one. Six, eight, two, I'll look in. Okay, six can't be here. Six can be one of those three. That's annoying. Okay, one, two, three, five, eight. I need four, six, seven, and nine. Nine's one of those two. I see six and nine, so this is four or seven. This sees four and nine, so this is six and seven. This one is six, seven, nine, and that one I think is any of them, yep. Well, those four nines don't exactly intersect. Poop. But let's see what I can do here. One and seven both look into box four. So one and seven both have to go here. That's a pair, which means this is a pair. Five and nine, and that one has a five looking at it. So this is nine, that one isn't. Let's see, that's a triple. I'm going to go ahead and mark it. Okay, this one, all right, these are four, seven, five, and nine. Okay, so nine's there. Five is in one of those two. So 5 and 9 occupy two of these three cells. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, the whole middle third, every row has five digits in it. Uh, what's in left in here are 3, 9 for the odd digits and 4 for the even digits along with 5. What's left in here, I don't see too much looking into it. Oh, 2 is one of these two. By Bill's two twos. 15789, I need 2, 3, 4, and 6. Okay, those are two, three, four, and can't be six. This is three, four, six. This is... Oh, that can't be two either. Okay, six is here, two is here, but that doesn't tell me anything useful. Two, three, four, six, eight. Okay, so all the even digits are in row six. That means these are one, five, nine, because they can only be odd digits. That's two thirds of a triple. Hmm. Remember, they can't be three, and these can't be one. So none, of, neither of those are one or three. So these are five, seven, nine, aren't they? And seven's one of those two. OK, 
Okay, that says one is in one of these two. Five is in one of those two. Unfortunately, that doesn't tell me anything about where any of the other digits might be. Uh, let's see. Okay, 8251, except nothing else. So, oh, wait a minute. Yeah, if I do another vertical scanning, I just noticed something. This 2-1 and this 2-1 are both in boxes 6 and 9 in columns 7 and 8. So 2 and 1 here and here force 1 and 2 into these two cells. Because that's a hidden pair. This cell has a 1 looking at it. Therefore, it must be 2, and that's a 1. Remember, 1 and 2 are both locked out of all six of these cells by these ones and these ones, respectively. That's how I could figure that one out. Are there any other hidden pairs like that? Not that I can see, at least not easily. Okay, 1539, so the only odd digit, this could be a 7. It sees the rest, and it sees 2 and 8, so 4, 6 are the only ones left. That's 2 thirds of a 4, 6, 7. Do I have another one that's a 4, 6, 7? That doesn't interact with this or these, unfortunately. Okay, I just filled this in. Uh, eight must be there, which we could have seen from those eights. And this eight looks up. Two, three, five, eight. Okay, I need one, four, six, seven, nine for the rest of row eight. This is one, four, or six only because it's C seven and nine. I think this could be anything. This is one, six, seven because it can't be four or nine. And wait a minute, that's a triple. Look at column one. So this is a triple that just formed. So I've got one, six, seven. Okay, so these two are two and three, which are not resolved in the column, but that does give me a two, three pair in the box. This is two, five, three, nine. So this is something along the lines of one, four, six, seven, and I haven't put in an eight yet. Uh, one, four, six, seven, four, six, seven, eight, I think. Oh, six could still be here. That's annoying. If six wasn't here, then I'd have six and eight constrained to those two cells, and I'd actually have something, but I don't, uh, actually. But, oh, one can't be here or here or here. So that wasn't hopeful either. Hmm. Anyway, where were we? One, four, six, seven, nine. And row eight is complete, but that can't be seven. Hmm. Now I just noticed a two, four, eight, two, four, eight, and two, one, eight, two, one, eight, two, one, eight. There, okay. One, two, five, eight. I need three, four, six, seven, and nine for row three. This is three, four, or six. It can't be seven or nine. This is four or nine only. What, what do we say? Three, four, six, seven, nine, but it's C, six, seven, and three. And it also sees nine in the box. That is a hidden four. All B. All B. Okay. Uh, that puts
puts four in those. I think. Yeah, because these can't be four. Okay, six, seven forces that to be a four. So these aren't. That's now a triple. Five, seven, and nine are a triple. So what that means is nothing else. Be five, seven, or nine. So those aren't seven. Neither is that. So one, four, six, eight. That's a quad there. <coughs> uh, what do we say? Three, six, seven. Now, I haven't put nine in, but I know it goes in one of those two. Unfortunately, those look like, yeah, three, six, seven, nine. Those could be anything. Okay, these two cells see two, four, five, eight, nine. So they are explicitly one, three, six, seven. And this sees everything but one. Two four five eight nine one three six six. Yeah, two four five eight nine one three six seven. Oh yeah. Five is there, but unfortunately three crosses a region. That's not what I wanted to see. I still don't have much coming down here yet, uh Okay, these are two five eight nine. Column six is done. This cell is the only one left from column four. It cannot be three six uh, three seven eight nine. But it can be any of the others excepting one. Uh oh. One six one four six. I just noticed something. That one four six. This is also a triple because there's only one place for seven in row eight, right here. And the only place for a nine, once a seven's gone, is right here. So nine will place one five uh, nine. Let's see, those aren't nine. That's not five. Okay, this is now a seven nine, as expected. Not five. Not seven. Okay, so this is five and nine. As a pair. Okay, what have I done vertically? Uh, I did do something. That's the only place for one in column four. So six, four. Uh, that must be eight. So that must be one. Seven, one. This seven in column two places six and seven. So these aren't seven. Three, five, six. That's left as a triple, but six looks in here. Three. Exiting this six, two. Eight, seven. Okay, this is now a four, six pair. So these aren't six. And three looks at it from the row. So this is seven, nine. These are going to be three, five. Two, three looks down here in column four. Placing four, six. Eight looks down. So those are two, five. That, this is now a pair. Four and eight, from the looks of things. This cell has an eight looking at it to its left. I can place four, eight, three, two, three in row four, places four, five. Three, six pair in row five is left. If 
Got the 5 in column 8. Comes up 3, 5. And then I come down 6, 3. 6 comes back up 4, 6. I can't do anything else with it. Okay, this is a pair. 3 and 4. And this has a 4 looking at it. 3, 4. Uh, this one is the other of 7, 9 with a 7 looking at it. So I want my 7, 9 to resolve, and we're just writing in digits at this point. Okay, these two are 6 and 7, and they go in that order. Okay, uh, 3 places 2, 3, 5, 9, 2, 5, and we're done in like 16 minutes and the key I thought was looking at the left side of this grid the per the triples in purple and in green are the ones that essentially unlock the puzzle once I hit the triple in orange everything else flowed relatively easily after that and thank you for joining me this afternoon